Hey everybody, Flying Brian here. Today's a project day. That sink behind you is one that my wife has been complaining about. It's been draining slower and slower. It's an American standard sink and faucet and a drain. And they are notorious, at least the later model ones, for collecting hair and gunge and just getting just plugged up. So today I'm going to show you how to get the plug out, clean this thing out, maybe save yourself a plumbing bill. So the first order of business is to get everything out that my wife has accumulated underneath the, the vanity. Oh my goodness, I've got everything out. She has stashed like a million things under there. Let's see what's under here. Okay, that is the trap. There is the cold water supply behind there. I don't know if you can see it. Hot water supply. I don't really need to cut any of that stuff off. There is a single black cable that goes to the spout there. And that is what I've got to get off. It's probably one of the good things to, to have handy as a towel or some paper toweling because there will probably be a little bit of water to come out of this as I get it disassembled. All right, once everything is out, this is the control for the stopper. You basically come in, give this a quarter turn, and it comes right off like that. And then you'll need a little screwdriver, perhaps. Maybe get out with my fingers. Nope. You'll need a little screwdriver, kind of like what I have here. Flat tip is good. And you should be able to pry out this right here. There it is. This is where the water might come out. And then there's also right behind that is a little control arm thing. This. Ooh, it's already got some gunge on it. Not a good sign. Now that's all I need and I can go up above and pull that plunger out. All right, the moment of truth. Ooh. That doesn't look good. That looks tasty. Yummy. You can actually see clear down the drain now that glow down there is the peat trap. That's where the light down below is just coming through the plastic. And it looks pretty clean. I'm gonna run a paper towel down there. There's a little bit of gunginess right there. But I'll clean that up and then I'll put it back together. Okay, that's it. Now all I gotta do is put this back in. And if you look, there is a front and a back. It is important that you drop this in with that little tang facing the back of the drain. That's it. Okay, we're gonna take this little piece. That goes in first, little hook. Make sure it faces down, and then it goes into that little tying. Now, we're gonna take this little ring and place it back into its seat here. There we go. And last is to reattach this. Not too tight. That's good. And that pretty much is how you get it in. Let's see if it works. Yep. See if it drains. Also make sure there's no leaks down below. And there's that. Thank you for watching. Remember, life's a journey. Enjoy the ride.